Hello everyone, my name is Akshat. I am from ECE and uh, I achieved All India Rank 760 in this year 2021 uh, in ECE paper. And uh, first of all, I would like to thank to Sahaf sir and uh, their videos which helped me a lot in uh, uh, securing this rank. I have completely followed their videos and uh, uh, nothing else. Uh, I mean, obviously, I have took some test series and uh, uh, solved some books in the end, but uh, uh, my preparation part was completely based on their videos. So, uh, my, I started my preparation when I was in final year of my BTEC uh, in 2019. Uh, so, uh, I have I've graduated in 2020. So, uh, I've already completed 70% of GATE syllabus when I was in my final year. Uh, but my, uh, you know, uh, my uh, question solving was not very good and I didn't solve much questions. I've just completed the course so it didn't help me when I gave my first attempt and I got 4000 rank which was uh, uh, decent but it was not very good to get into any IIT because you know I I have I was having a CGPA of uh, just 6.3 and uh, I was not even eligible for CCMT counseling so the NIT part is already gone and uh, uh, because the CGPA is less so I am also not eligible for uh, MTech research programs in IIT so uh, previous year uh, I got nothing with this GATE score. So in last two, three or four months, I, I, I was quite confused that what I have to do next because uh, uh, my GATE score was not very good to get into IIT, get into an IIT and uh, uh, I was confused that what I have to do. And then uh, in August or uh, September uh, 2020, I, uh, I thought that let's prepare and give one last attempt for GATE uh, very seriously. So I, I have two things now that first thing is that uh, the syllabus which I have already completed the 70% of the syllabus I have to revise it properly because uh, you know in last five or six months you forgot everything whatever you have just gone through uh, previous time so I revised everything it took me around one or two months and then whatever the part which I have left which I had left when I was in final year which includes communication systems and uh, also some part of electromagnetism major part of electromagnetism so i have completed all of those part uh, from uh, mostly from software videos and uh, uh, for the digital communication i preferred some books and other sources uh, but apart from that i completely uh, prepared myself uh, with the videos of Sir, which are on their youtube channel uh, those videos are really rich in uh, quality and uh, I think that uh, um, um, the entire credit of my rank goes to those videos. Uh, so in at the end of October, I completed approximately 80 to 85 percent of the course and then some part of uh, you know some part was uh, was very tough for me. I found difficult so I skipped some part, for example antenna, uh, the digital communication part of you know uh, information theory and those part I have skipped and uh, I have took a test series of ACE Engineering Academy and uh, I started giving those um, tests I started uh, from October and in January I uh, I gave a full length test around 15, 10 to 15 full length tests and in the test series I was getting marks around 50 to 60 in the middle of that most of the times and sometimes even I got 40 marks as well so you know marks in the test series doesn't matter uh, I was also getting demotivated sometimes but then I realized that uh, uh, it's time not to demotivate yourself but uh, to maintain the preparation whatever you have done in last five or six months so somehow i am able to hold myself and uh, i also gave uh, gate in instrument instrumentation branch as well because this year uh, 
you are allowed to give gate in two papers so i chose instrumentation as my secondary subject and uh, obviously electronics was uh, my primary so uh, in in instrumentation i got uh, 579 uh, rank with 53.3 marks and ec paper this year was quite tough so i got only 46 marks uh, committed a lot of mistakes but uh, it's okay and uh, uh, i got 760 rank uh, at such a low score so uh, the paper this year was quite um, you know some questions were controversial and uh, quite unpredictable lengthy and the you know easy part that our uh, control system student find control systems signals and those topics quite easy but this year in gate exam and the questions from those uh, topics were quite tedious and uh, on the difficult side so uh, you know uh, i was very uncomfortable in the first uh, first half an hour or one hour of the paper but then i uh, composed myself and uh, i thought that uh, okay what just do what you uh, what you're able to do and uh, don't get panic so that's the strategy i followed during the examination it was uh, you know a very uh, situation in which you find yourself in in a huge pressure so uh, it completely depend on your uh, personality or your capability of handling pressure that how you handle pressure in such situations so it is also a very important thing and uh, that's all about my preparation i i followed some books uh, also but uh, uh, for you know the part which solves or left for example digital communication when i was uh, in I was preparing at October uh, Saaf sir at Saaf sir YouTube channel he approximately covered 90% of the course but uh, some topics you know were remained uh, untouched by them as well so I have completed I have not completed them some of them like antenna and uh, some part of digital communication I skipped completely and uh, some of the part I have completed from other references and books but uh, you know lastly i want to say that uh, if you are aiming for top rank then uh, i assure you that if you uh, if you watch the entire videos of sahab sir and if you are from ece then uh, then i think that you will surely get under 50 or uh, under 100 rank very easily not very easily obviously you have to work hard you have to give and attempt many test series as possible you have to solve questions very much but i think the uh, content and uh, the videos content of the videos which he had uh, he has in his youtube channel was quite amazing and uh, i think that you can achieve a very good rank by covering all all of those videos so last but not least i would like to thank to saaf sir because uh, i think they deserve the entire credit of uh, my achievement so thank you very much and all the best for the uh, aspirants uh, who are preparing for next year for the gate thank you